erectile dysfunction is a sexual disorder in which uh, the quality of erection is not sufficient enough of the penile region to attain a satisfactory sexual intercourse. There are many causes to it. If I take the most common cause, it can be a psychogenic, like uh, the youngsters who are high achievers, they are always tense, there's a lot of stress, they, they, uh, they are smokers, they drink alcohol, all these things they attribute to erectile dysfunction. And once they have a uh, erectile dysfunction in the beginning, they go into a cycle of performance anxiety. They can't perform. Then again, there is a stress. So that it goes into a circle. So this is one of the causes of erectile dysfunction. Secondly, there can be a hormonal problem. There can be a vascular problem. The, the blood supply to the organ is not sufficient. That could be one of the reasons. There can be neurogenic problem. Neurogenic is <clears throat> the pa <clears throat> patients who have got diabetes, they have got a di uh, diabetic neuropathy and the sensations, they go down. So there can be hormonal problem, vascular problem, neurogenic problem, there can be a psychogenic problem. These are the main causes of erectile dysfunction in a young male adult. Infertility we define when the semen quality is poor, that means the sperms are either absent, they are low in number, their uh, motility of the sperm is poor, or their morphology is poor. And there are many causes of infertility. Uh, in generally, we can divide this into medical causes and surgical causes. The medical causes are mainly pertaining to uh, hormonal problem, developmental problem in a male where you find that there's a, a obese patient who has got a lack of secondary sexual characters, the testicle size are small, there can be congenital absence of the vast difference. So these are the causes. Then coming to the surgical, the most common cause is uh, presence of varicose seal. Now you will ask me what is a varicose seal? Varicose seal is nothing but the dilatation, abnormal dilatation of the veins above the testicle. Because urinary system exists in every human being. So it's wrong to think that the problems will only come when your car is aging. Prostatitis, which is solely a problem of a male person. Now male, especially younger age group. Prostatitis, if you break the word, itis means inflammation of the prostate gland which usually occurs in a younger age group, especially below the age of 50 years. When there's a urinary bladder, there's a tube which comes out of the urinary bladder, which is known as urethra. It is surrounded by prostate. Sometimes the junction of prostate and the urinary bladder is a little high up and the flow is poor. So it is not prostatitis, but it is a high bladder neck. Uh, 